Okay, so this is just a quick little painting tip that I wish I would have known earlier when I was younger. Uh, instead of having to clean a paintbrush every day when you're done with paint thinner or gasoline or any sort of, um, sort of thinning agent, um, some painter told me once that the only thing that makes the paint hard is air. So as long as you can take away the air and put a little bit of paint on the bristles, they'll last for a really long time. So you can see here, I've got a couple paint brushes and these are about a month old now. And there's just no air getting to them. And they're still wet. You see, they're still good. They're still able to be used after a month because all I do when I'm finished with my paint today, here's the painting that I've been doing today, and I just make the bristles a little bit wet, put them back with the other bristles, put them in a couple plastic bags, and they're good for a month or longer. The more bags you put on, the longer it'll last. So there's three bags and that's pretty good for a month. By the way, these are just dollar store paintbrushes. They're nothing special. It's not like I'm breaking the bank on these. And another thing they work, this works for is uh, caulking. This caulking is about a month old now as well. And you can just store your caulking and your paint in plastic bags. Let's see if I pull them, oh, there he goes. We'll see if that works. <laughs> but uh, there's a little life hack for you. So just as a quick follow-up, uh, just to prove my point, this is about a month old, this uh, outdoor, outside window caulking. And just gonna pull that out. And you can see that there's still Tons of beautiful caulking left. And this is about a month old. So again, you just wrap this stuff in plastic bags and don't let the air get to it basically. And the more plastic bags you have wrapped around them, whatever it is, the longer they'll last. So good luck.